You've probably heard the golden rule, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. The astrology of the middle of July 2023 is a continuous lesson in switch it, turn it around, treat yourself as you would the best person in your life. This is a challenge for a lot of us. We are trained to put other people first, to have nice things, but uh, save them. Save them for the special times. Well, guess what? Every day is a special time. You are a special person 24-7, and this week is one huge atomic blast subtly awakening in you the desire and the impulse and the imperative to make sure your emotional needs are met, to shake things up in your own life so that you get what you need, you feel safe and secure. And I know, yes, there are things out in the world that make that really tricky, but as best you can in your own little nest, set things up so that you feel good and right and special. Use all the, we've all got them. Use the body sprays. Use all those special soaps you have lying around. Fix the things in your kitchen that aren't quite right. I just replaced my French press because it goes down at an angle and it's really hard to pour it and I'm tired of wiping up coffee. So I got a new, pretty, copper, visually appealing one. And that will be a daily delight from now on. Simple things. Wear clothing that makes you feel good. Strut. Um, dress up. Don't save your china or your favorite dishes for when company comes over. Get yourself flowers. Do nice things for yourself on a constant basis. Maybe you don't have a lot of money. And that should not be a barrier here. There are tiny things you can do, tiny things, tiny steps you can take on a regular basis that make you feel better, special. Brush your damn hair. Wear makeup if it feels good. Wear pearls. I recently met someone who has moon and Taurus who admitted that she actually wears an inherited fur when she works in her garden. And no, no nonsense here in the comments about fur, okay? Inherited. And her point being, I own it. It feels good. Why shouldn't I? Use what you have. The moon's nodes have moved into Aries. It's time to put yourself first. And here's your inspirational image that's a guideline for how to handle things. And since the nodes have just moved into Aries, we've got about a year and a half of really exploring this. And that is the Nine of Pentacles. Here is a woman who is well off. She's wearing really frou-frou clothing in her beautiful, beautiful garden, and she has a freaking bird of prey on her hand. She has enough that she can indulge. She's out there enjoying the fruits of her labor. She's enjoying what she has. Use this as your model and have fun with it. Venus and Leo loves to have a good time. Strut.